Good morning, this is Farmer Brad, and I'm going to get some eggs prepped in the incubator so that in 21 days I'll be able to have some baby chicks to replace some of my older layers. So here's what I have I have the Brinza Mini 2 Advance Incubator. Uh, this thing looks really great. So, first thing, this will be the tray that goes in there, and then they included this hatching tray so that once I take that out and then they're going to start hatching, then they'll be able to just hatch and crack their eggs on there. So, first thing I need to do is fill up the water reservoir. So it has this reservoir here, and then it has this external one, and that way you can fill it, refill it out here, and then it fills up even here. So then uh, I put this cap on, put the egg tray there. Now when storing these eggs, I put the small point down so that it does not disrupt the um, air sac in these eggs. Now, unfortunately, these are a little bit dirtier than I had anticipated, but um, we've had some rain the last couple days. But you do not want to wash these eggs. Um, you want to leave them in their natural state. And you have about 12 days from the point of them starting to lay. Um, so I gathered these over the course of probably about three or four days and I have one rooster and three or four hens in a chicken tractor and um, so hopefully all of these will be fertilized. So what we do is we find the best ones and we set them in the incubator like that. And so this will rotate um, this will rotate the eggs. So I'm putting the small points in. Okay, so once I have those in there, then we set this on top, uh, making sure that the gear there is in place. And then I plug it in, and from the factory, it's configured for pin. So it will get the temperature up to the right, right stage, it will automatically rotate, and we're good to go. Um, so I'll update the uh, status of these hatching eggs. On Instagram and uh, thanks for watching if you have any questions or comments uh, I'll leave just leave them in the comments of this video and uh, thanks and have a great day